create table from the ribbon using the insert table command. Create a table using the ribbon. I'll select a range using shortcut keys control plus shift plus spacebar, then click insert from the menu. Select tables, followed by table, then click OK. Rename the table by typing a new table name in the text box. Now you can select the table from the name box. Using shortcut keys. Create table by placing the cursor in the data range and hitting the Ctrl plus Shift plus Spacebar keys, followed by hitting the Ctrl plus T keys, then OK on the range. Add and remove rows and columns to a table using the right-click menu and shortcut keys. Add rows and columns to table using the menu. I click row 7, then right-click and select Insert. Similarly, I'll add a column by selecting column B. Right-click and select Insert, to add a new column. Similarly, I'll remove rows and columns to table using the menu. Using the mouse, I click row 7. Right click and select delete. I'll delete column B by selecting column B, right click and select delete. Next, I'll add rows and columns to a table using shortcut keys. I select row 7 then hit Ctrl plus Shift plus addition keys. I'll add a column to a table using shortcut keys. I select column B then hit Ctrl plus Shift plus addition keys. Finally, I'll remove rows and columns to a table using shortcut keys. I'll select row 7 then hit the Ctrl and minus keys to remove row 7. Next, I'll select column B then hit the Ctrl and minus keys to remove column B. Filter table in ascending or descending order. Filter on text and custom filtering. We'll filter the table in ascending order by selecting the cost drop down, then select sort smallest to largest. Next, I'll filter the table in descending order by selecting the revenue drop down, then select sort largest to smallest. I'll filter the table on text by selecting the bike drop down, then typing BMX in the search text box, followed by clicking OK. I'll clear the filter from the table by selecting the bike drop down then either checking select all, or clear filter from bike. Finally, I'll create a custom number filter to the table, by selecting number filters, and between, from the ID drop down. I type 12 and 45 into the text boxes, followed by OK. Aggregating table data, sum, count, and average table columns. I'll aggregate the table by summing the cost column. I go to the first row after the end of the table and click the sum drop down on the home tab. I'll aggregate the table by averaging revenue. I go to the first row after the end of the table and click average from the sum drop down on the home tab. You can aggregate the table by counting the numbers. Just click count numbers from sum drop down. Changing and removing table styles. Change or clear table styles. Place the cursor inside the table, so that the table design menu appears. Click table design, followed by, quick styles. Select the style you want, or clear link at the bottom of the palette. 